Ah, dude, what's up? So I didn't even change the scenery. So I was like, yep, too much Dark Souls without recording and with recording. I haven't played Ark at all today, so I was like, yep, I need a man up and just play this. <laughs> uh shit. Wait, what that say? R2 multiplayer. Pardon? Excited to announce R2 multiplayer sandbox survival game starring Vin Diesel as Santiago in the Ark anime series explore. Oh, okay, so they're just talking about, like, you know, it's, it's coming at some point. I thought it was, like, in a beta format, and then people were allowed to play. Spencer, get out of there, buddy. What are you doing, man? I put those newspapers there to so you wouldn't step on it. You piece of shit. You better not piss in that. Uh, there's newspapers right below your fucking litter box, and I swear, if you take a dump there, man, I'm gonna be salty. What are you doing, boy? Like, I hope that you think of that as a chilling area, not, oh yeah, I'm gonna go take a shit here tonight. So sometimes when I make, like, stacked formations in my place, or any time, even when I was at my, uh, living with my dad and stuff, like, five plus years ago, um, back when I was, like, 20, or maybe 19, or 21, whatever, either or. <laughs> I just know that when I was checking my lease, it said I was at like 2016 or something. I thought I moved in here sooner than that, but alright. I definitely know it was a couple years after I graduated. Because it was like high school and then two years worth of college, which I didn't even pay attention into because I didn't like it. And then I realized, hey, I'm better at labor work. I want to grow muscle. I want to be strong boy. It's for like the longest time I've been called a toothpick. Now it's more like, oh shit, you're stronger than you look. <laughs> so it's like I'm past that point of like, medium boy and uh, muscle. So it's like, sure, gaining weight's good, but like if you don't exercise enough, it could be a problem. Like it'll it'll look weird. That's why I'm happy my job makes me use my legs, my knees, my fucking arms, my chest, even my back, uh, my shoulders too, a little bit of everything. Especially since I try to overachieve too. So it makes just everything all around easier. <sighs> but, yep. I think today I can do a couple of things. I can go and try to gather some elements. Or I can go and try to, uh, anything. I kind of want to set up a path so that way I can pick up my loot since I can't transfer right now. So I think what I'll do before I do anything else, I want to try to set up a, uh, a, a craft. So for now, let's just beef up these dinos and shit. I'm happy to know my base hasn't been destroyed since I've been gone for a good day or two. Oh. A leveling up a dino crashes the game. I, I know that on uh, some of these maps there's these people who have like a shit ton of turns and they probably have like 30,000 dinos just breeding constantly in like little chambers and shit. But it's usually when you see this type of lag it can be a good thing too, because for getting to and from places is annoying, I get it. But if you think about it, the fact that we've even got kicked out like this, this just means that on this map, there is some location that has a shit ton of loot. And seeing as most people don't go on to Bulgaria half the time, whoever owns it must be very confident in their defenses. So, you know, for them to come back and everything be gone, I think that'd be great. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good to me. But yeah, my favorite thing to do though is make a tech sword and uh, get a paracer built up and back up to the turrets and just knock them out. Some people don't know how to do the cliff platform glitch where like you make turrets float. I forget how that works. It's like something to do with, like you put a bunch of pillars and a cliff platform and then you remove the bottom pillar or one of the ones in the middle. Something like that. Are you shitting me? Another disconnect. Wow. What's going on? 
<laughs> Should I even be playing right now? Shit. Like, I just want to make a video. Fuck you too, Ark. And uh, as I stated back when I had that Captain Noodle channel, anytime I do these videos, I almost always go non-edited. Oh, I see. I liked out because two other people were entering. <laughs> Sons of bitches. I know the signs when new players pop in too, they spam the levels real quickly, much like I do the same. And usually whenever you level up really quickly like that, it usually creates high ping in the server because you're putting everything through stress. Most of the time you're not supposed to level up that quickly, that's why it takes a long time to go from level 62 to 70 and 70 to 80 and 80 to 90. It's just like any game. I'm sure, like, because of that type of stuff, I wouldn't be surprised, like, if enough play, if enough people. Alrighty. So back to what I was trying to say. Let's make sure I'm actually yeah, not in public chat. Uh, looks like my base is all right. That's a good thing. Let's see. Yep. So you're healed up a little bit better. That's good. I want to go take a look and see. see trying to look for any kind of sleeping bags or anything really the angle on that doesn't really help but it's decent yeah, if I can see my foundation stuff that's supposed to be my this little room here is going to be where I transfer transfer my goodies to and from so it'll be good when it's done but since it's not, it's gonna be a while. A fart. Uh, let's see, it's probably gonna be a start bed. I really hope I have some loot in here. If not, then I'm gonna have to like, grind my heart out or something. I forget. Most of the time I, I give myself a gathering thing in this type of place. Another thing I could do too. Oh, come on, really? Really, you're stuck. Wow. Sons of bitches. Alright. Oh, oh, I see the ramp disappeared. Fuck. Alright. What's in here? Meat, weapons. Eh. Nothing really too important. Really? There we go. I'm just trying to switch my hoyman on here. I think this this thing connects. So I'll pick up this bed. I want to see maybe I can make a ramp going into here, and uh, I'll put my spawn point somewhere else. Ceiling. Yep, now we got a little bit more room. That ain't too bad. And I think that's the cabinet I was supposed to use for my other thing. Let me see how much it costs to actually build that. I'm pretty sure it's rudimentary stuff. Yeah, like five or thatch wood. Yep. So I'm thinking like maybe I'll just gather a shit ton and then I'll re-teleport into here. Probably. That might be the easiest option. I think I'm going to try to pick that up. This area doesn't need to be like super accessible, so I just want to get like all the basics knocked out of here. Yeah, this thing doesn't carry much of anything, so fuck it. I'll take that, thank you. Uh -huh. So we'll take this. Oh. oh, come on, really? It's the wall, bro. I'm trying to get the ceiling. Thank you. There we go. Alrighty. So what we need now is a uh, wall, ceiling, blah, 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 a little bit of everything. But for now, let's go put the bed over here. And maybe it'll be out of the way, I hope. And we'll take a stone wall and we'll, yeah, we'll put it here. Fuck it. 
I'm just hoping that we pick a place that will actually work with what I'm trying to do. Nah, fuck it up. Also, it is mad fucking dark. God damn. Oh, now I'm stuck. Uh oh. oh come on. There you go. Nice. Cool. Alrighty. Alright, so now we'll get this. Right about there. Trying to find. I'm trying to find that very specific spot that we gotta mess with. Because it's gonna be right here. But it's like there's this tiny, tiny gap. I want that tiny gap right here to contain uh, my stuff. So I think what we need is probably another wall and a bunch of other shit. Stairs, even. So first things first, let's, let's take this, do that, and then I'll pick this up too. So I'm pretty sure I could just make a wall and some stairs right up here. Shouldn't be that hard to do. And then now I just want to take all of this, and we'll just stuff it over here. Yeah, that's why I got a little place to put some stuff. Yep. Another thing that'd be good, uh, I was gonna say I could put some spikes to keep people from putting spawn points out here, but what I want to do is I want to make this like metal or tech or something at some point, and then uh, I would have my uh, cupboard up top with the stairs, just so people can't just look through the gap and just put spawn points. Because that's what I'm trying to avoid. I want people to like easily get in here, much like how I did. Because I think. I think there's two spots with gaps in it actually, let me see. Let's see. Uh, that spot doesn't have a gap. But then, that spot does. I don't see any other, oh, there's one over here. And that might be a problem. So that pretty much lets you see directly down there. Fuck. I'm gonna have to put like a, a tech ceiling or something at some point, or a metal ceiling. <laughs> you know, hopefully no one really can do damage to it looking through that gap. It might be very hard to do, or maybe you have to put like C4 or something and then try to make your spawn point in here. But it's such an annoying rat hole, you would have to like leave the map, come back, leave the map, come back. Like you would have to transfer out and respawn back in just to be at the right spot. So, oh, I need to rename this. Let's rename this one loot transfer. This way I have a little spot for this stuff. Yeah, loot transfer. And, uh, oh, I have parachutes on me. Whoops. I forgot I had that on my hotbar. There we go. Because for the time that I do end up getting a transmitter, you know, I could eventually take care of this stuff the way it should be. Much like how I had my other base uh, on this same map, but different server. All right, so let's get going. Let's go over here, outer. Yep. And at some point, I want to get a bunch of different spawn points because I don't want someone to shut me in here. Because you know, then I have no way to like starve myself out, or I think I'm pretty limited in organic polymer. If anything, I'm gonna sit here and feed myself raw meat which I have a good amount of health to deplete, but I think raw meat spoiled me with them. <sighs> yeah, but yeah, I need a little bit of everything. A bit of stone, a bit of wood. Oh shit. Hello. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Let's just jump down. Uh, shit, there's a raptor. Ow. I failed. I meant to do that quicker. It's like that commercial with a dollar guy. He's like, oh, you gotta be quicker than that. Get away from me, raptor. Really? You're gonna go after me and not the other guy? Level 156 piece of shit. You're gonna kill me. Damn it. 
Jeez. Oh, Jerboa. But yeah, we have quite a bit to do. And hopefully I can get that transmitter today or tomorrow. But yeah, there's something I need to do to make my job easy. I, uh, I could probably tame a dire wolf. Or I could go and tame something else. Maybe a monkey. And then I could use a pickaxe. And, uh, lunar biome. So that would mean going to Genesis, going to the Arctic biome, doing that, which I don't mind. But yeah, off we go. Hopefully that drop here lets me get out of here. Excuse me, raptors and everything else. Man on mission coming through. But yeah, we won't be doing any too aggressive of PvP quite yet. I still need to get like my dinos and stuff. Oh shit. Of course there'd be an aloe right fucking there. Of course. Now if I get some spears I might be able to fight back pretty good. Maybe not that great but I think I'm fully regenerated anyway. I should be fine. Just get some basic armor and I need to see what I need for a... Oh I need wood. Alright I can do that. So I think the aloe's gotta go if I'm gonna get out of here. Defend me. Cool. So yeah, my game plan though is like get a monkey, go to Luna Bind with a cryopod because I have points over there, and then I can come back with a bunch of element dust. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh boy. At least I got a weapon this time. <laughs> now I can get some hide. Hell yeah. Cool. Alright, so we need some spears. I'll make some hide armor real quick. Now we have a little bit more defended. <laughs> sure, I got almost 2,000 health, but... Mm, I'm not exactly an expert fighter at the moment. But if I can take myself a tier ahead, that's good enough for me. I know where those aloes go. So I want to try to grab up whatever's in there and then leave, but if they're right around the loot drop, I ain't taking it. Where did they go? What the fuck? Huh. Okay. So be it. Yeah, there's bullshit in there. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't hit refresh. That refresh trophy thing takes like a minute. And that minute when you're trying to leave feels like five minutes. It feels like an eternity. Fuck you, Raptor. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Asshole. Also, I'm kind of hoping, though, if I do end up with enough points in Genesis, I wonder if this server has a thing where, like, you get blueprints for saddles all the time. So, like, if I'm in Genesis... Would I get a blueprint for a Magnus or would I get a blueprint for a Basilisk? Like, you know, these are the type of dinos that are within this biome. Asked to see this too. Yep, I shall return. So yeah, even on official though, 
Y'all can use the same idea. It actually works pretty good. You just gotta be careful. It's half the time. Most servers on official have a shit ton of people. So you might not have as easy access to stuff as I do. But, yeah. Oh, hey, there's a person. Ooh, 17. I think I've seen that person before. Hmm. See how derpy this shit looks. Make sure I pull them to a safe spot. <laughs> that bass looks so fucking derpy. That's funny as hell. I just wish they had some loot on them. It would have been funnier. I would have been like, oh, thanks for the cryopods. Now, what's that PSN? ATY 2006. Alright, so they're a little bit younger than me. By now, I think 2006 people are like 19 or 20. So I'm thinking I'm 94, 2006. That's like what? 12, 12 year difference. Actually, yeah, they'd be a lot younger than me. 26 minus 12. 14, maybe 15. Depends on which month they were born. Hmm. I mean, yeah, they're definitely old enough to play the game, that's for sure. So I, I think, in my opinion, most people should at least like have some puberty changes to their voice before they play ARK. Because, sure, the game's rated T, I think, for, like, you know, dinosaurs and shit, but there's a lot of evil and crazy shit that goes on. Both with the dinosaurs, the story, um, not to mention, um, oh, what am I looking for to say? Oh, yeah, the community, because, like, whereas I get pretty toxic with some stuff I do, like, sure, I may mesh back people, or I don't know how to dox, or I don't know how to hack or anything, but yeah, I've, I've been hacked, I've been doxed, uh, but to be honest, I think the worst thing beyond that is when people like try to go through like a uh, I would say the, the deep insults like if they know someone personally like they know someone for like 15 years or maybe maybe three or four and I know a bunch of like big things about that person and then the first thing they do is hey I don't like what you did in the game so I'm gonna go tell like all the people around the lobby about your personal shit say so you're fucking welcome <laughs> I think that would be pretty bad. And uh, that's the type of toxicity I've seen. And usually I don't pay attention, but some people do. Like, they'll be taking notes and shit. Like, hmm, so that's what that person's BS is. Okay. Never like, stop, don't tell anyone about that. But sometimes you get people who go, all right, you know, this is part of me. I can accept that now. So if anything, it might even strengthen the person. But some people don't have that, uh, capability of uh, strengthening themselves. Instead they get suicidal or they get like super depressed or too angry and they do something in real life and then they fuck themselves up. So if anything you're not like starting shit like oh like oh I made this person go kill someone or oh I did this like you know and you can kind of be the reason why it happened but if you're the reason why that means that person would have been broken sooner or later anyway. Because if they're messed up enough to do those things right off the bat, as soon as you do something, a complete stranger and or like semi friend or long time friend, either either way, another person, uh, that person was meant to break at that point or a point soon after, even without knowing you or the other person involved. So I mean, makes sense, right? I mean, most people probably don't talk about this stuff when they when I play ARC, but it, just, it got me thinking, you know, thinking about stuff I've seen, stuff I've talked about, or uh, things I've said to people, vice versa. It ain't gonna stop me from talking shit, though. Like if someone goes like, oh, like, fuck you, buddy, like, you were a bitch piece of shit, I'd be like, oh, you're that insecure, huh? What happened? Did you get abused as a child? I'd be like, you can't talk about my abuse, yeah. You know, like, I hated the fact that I was abused. The abuse is not a joke. It's like, then why are you trying to fuck with me? The guy who's stuck on a joke about your dark side. 
<laughs> like you're talking to the wrong dude, man. Simple as that. Fucking dumbasses. But yeah, let's go for 30,000 health and then a shit ton of melee. Yep. And we'll be getting more. Definitely. I just want to test this thing out now. I'm probably going to die trying to do such a thing, but I just want to see if I can get some points. That Therizino is getting really close. I don't like it. Go away. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Fuck you. There is Inho. Let's see if let's get some wood. Alright, she got any loot in there? Nope. Damn it. <sighs> but yeah, this is what we'd be doing. We'd be taking this monkey and uh, going around a looter by him. Things still needs to get a regen, but eh, we'll be fine. I could always pop the aberration and go kill some shit too. But nah. Also, I gotta find a safe place to teleport, so I think I'm gonna go for that guy's shitty random base over here. It looks almost like that one place I made when I was trying to hatch a dino, though. Is this it, actually? Yo, it is! What? I forget what the hell I was doing, but... Oh, it's when I hatched the Rex. Oh. Okay. So what happened? Did this get raided or something? Or did it just decay? Oh, no, that's been damaged. So I bet you someone saw this and was like, ah! <laughs> like, how dare you give me a fake base? They probably saw the Mortar and Pestles here and shit. They were like, what the fuck? <laughs> so if anything, I made someone waste their C4s, and that's amazing. Haha, <laughs> suck it. Bitch ass. I actually wonder if I'm in a tribe over here. Let's see. Okay. So, Groovy, level 323, Black Wolf. Wow. Hmm. That's, uh, that's a lot of stuff. October destroyed your thing. Alright, so definitely did some boss fights, though. So. Hmm. So I'm guessing this 323, though. Compared to uh, October. Yep. This is Black Wolf and then a player. Alright. Interesting. <laughs> I just think it's weird though, like this someone was someone bored and they just wanted to destroy something. Cause literally I put that there as a diversion, but it was also to raise my dino in a safe little square. I just think it's funny that they even went for that though. Like, if I was them I would feel ashamed. Oh well. Suck it. What is this? What the fuck? Uh That even go anywhere. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I don't understand, but all right. Uh. Yep. It is what it is, though. Yep. I see a lot of staircases that people did. Jeez. What the fuck? Is that a staircase for people who don't have ladders too? Or is that just pure ladder? I'm kinda curious now. So I wonder if the monkey can get up that. Whose is this? Rhyhorn Saddles. Huh. I feel like they would be a company, like in Ark, if this game had uh, companies in it. Actually, it kinda, it might even. A few would be like, oh, you wanna pay me in uh, blueprints? I mean, admin straight like that. They uh, say, hey, give me blueprints for, uh, you know, I'll trade the element or something. something. Oh, shit. I'm stuck. But this is the place to get the glitch, so I mean. Alright. Alright, monkey, you gotta stay put for a minute. I'll just give you some food to keep you busy. Yeah. Wish me luck. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll only be a little bit. I'm gonna make sure I crouch too, that way I don't fall. Cause I have a habit of like running over things and falling to my death. 
in almost every other game I've played, including Dark Souls. Oh, I don't like this. Is this a dead end? What's the point of that? It's a fucking... Why? There's that ladder there. Alright, so I got a risky move I'm gonna try. P. Oh. P. A. Alright, I'm gonna try to jump off and then parachute over to the, uh. to that other ladder. If I miss it, I miss it. I'll just keep going. Come on, man. No! Make it before you break it! Yeah, I made it! Nice. Sweet. Hell yeah. Ha <laughs> I bet you they did that and they were like, fuck! <laughs> That's probably why they did this, they were like, oh shit, I better like parachute over and then... Wait, wait. Oh god. Okay, we're safe. Whew. <laughs> this is kinda cool though, I always like climbing stuff, it's, it's awesome. So there's this fucking dude's failure. I should probably destroy those ceilings for him, but I think they're the very things that support this structure. Yeah, so they were determined to get this glitch, god damn. I could have just gone up to the hill here and... Oh. Ah, I see what the point of that was. They went to this ladder here so they can go all the way up and then, like, shoot themselves over that way. Hmm. But, like, why would you go that high up and for what purpose? Where were they going? Were they trying to make a base? Were they trying to escape from somebody? I want to know these things. Weird. Right, yep. Drop down. I almost want to call the monkey. See if it'll jump this way. Come on, buddy. Oh, you can do it. Yeah! <laughs> That was a lot funnier than it should have been. Alright, so let's see. Cryopod. Boom. And let's see here. I wonder how many uh, black pearls I can get. Let's see. So I think you got two back at base. So it's probably like, what, a thousand per piece? Oh, 300 per piece. Okay. Alright. I'm always tempted to look up how to get black pearls in Genesis. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm pretty sure it's the same deal. Like you go underwater and you get hoi noi. But uh, yeah, I, I got a lot of oxygen. I think the next time I level this thing, I'm gonna put a point of oxygen maybe. But uh, for now, we need to focus on element dust. Because if I can get like a hundred thousand, something like that, I think I would have plenty do everything I need to do because it, it costs like only a good little bit to do yeah regular element like for example most of the time you need a thousand element dust to make one element on this server you only need 300 so that's like 75% off so if you're, like, if you're buying something for $50 you know what I like you you only pay me 10 or 15 if you make me make you less, it'd be like, oh shit, I'll take that. It'd be like, oh, you cursed, make it 17. <laughs> you know? It'd be like, wait, I cursed, make it 16. You know, people will try to bargain like that. It's kind of funny. And the fact that it actually happens is even funnier. That's how business works, though. <sighs> Uh, come on, let me through. There you go. Told me. Nice. Alright, so here's how this is gonna go. Carbon, go into here. Um, uh, I got my weapons, I got some food. Let's go put this over here. I can definitely take this monkey back to base, but what I'll have to do, make sure that we're secured too. Um, I think this thing will resist damage pretty good, so I don't think I need to put like a helmet on him right now. Uh, but yeah, what we're gonna have to do is like we have to kill the enemy, I have to hop off, so I don't have a 
a good meat eater on me. And I have to manually grab up all that on the dust. It's gonna suck ass, but it's part of the uh, struggle. that level I want to try to get some oxygen this time come on man let me see how much that goes only 500 really what the fuck like, I, I got at least like 2,000 on me man I might, I might have better luck going under the water myself but yeah I mean I'm, I'm tempted to go into the ocean biome on this map but eh, I don't know if I'll find the creatures that give me the the pearls I'm looking for. It's gonna be kinda hard. Oh shit. Fuck you. That. Nice. I kinda wanna try to use the spear and see what I get. Alright, so we get 400. 760. So I wonder if using that type of weapon makes me gather more, because like, that's like a main damager, so usually when I do that I get a lot more meat than when I would uh, do another shit. Uh, so that's 360. So let me try to categorize how much we got. So let's see, in like, uh, let's say a thousand element, that's 369. Three, so that's three element. Uh, maybe four, possibly. So all right, so yeah, I'm still I still want to go for my uh, ninety thousand or so. Yep. So I still wish I had my Rex over here or something, but eh, this is all right. If I had a wolf, I'd be able to just om nom it and then take care of business. But maybe we wouldn't get that much element. Maybe it is better to do it this way. I'm not sure. Huh. <sighs> Wee. This thing really gets air time. I don't know if it's because of the type of creature it is, because it has super jump already. But, damn. Like, this is much higher than when I get flowing. And, like, I, I jump up and then floop. But, alright. I'll probably be able to cover this entire biome just doing this. <laughs> Let's kill that Rex. Come on, man. Haha. <laughs> uh, let me get him. Let me at him. Let me at him. Let me at him. <laughs> no. I need the element three. Let's see what he had on him. Hopefully there was like a pickaxe. Ah, man. That would have been cool. Little, little pick. Pick man. Alright, let's see if we'll do that. So now we got 2,000. I'm gonna kill this Rex. Hello, sir. I know I only have 2,000 health, but that's okay. I know that regen is not as fast on this map for some reason. But all the other maps are regen. It's like, meow. All right, see if let's take all that. That recipe can come in handy if I ever fuck up my stats. Um, yeah, put all this back into there. Now I got almost 3,000. That's cool. Oh, there's a loot bag. What do we got? Ah, oh, Tech Raptor. Okay. I see. Any armor that actually helps me? No. 11, 10. Alright. Whatever. But, yep, anytime I manage to get points, though, I'm definitely gonna go try to get some, um, stuff. Pearls. Yeah. Bring it back to base.
have it if I had the monkey throw me. <laughs> oh, that didn't help me at all. I didn't go nowhere. Yeah. I at least want to get up there and then shoot myself on that tiny island. I think that'd be pretty cool. It'd probably be plenty of Rexes and whatnot. Definitely on a slow regen map now. I'm only getting like one point per second. The other server, it's like several points per second, which is cool, but this time shit ain't happening. I'm tempted to kill these guys and get their element, but uh, I don't know, Rick. Oh no, Rick. Oh, oh geez. Oh. Hmm. Ha! Please work, please work, please work. Come on. Let me jump. Fuck you. Damn it. Yeah, fucking I'll let myself fall. Fuck you. Can I use my spear? Oh, look at that, I can. You be like, yeah. Good thing I can't hurt my own dying. That's a good thing. Ah, it sucks. Nice. Oh shit, Rex. Oh, wow, they really brought me all the way back over here. I think we definitely need like some gas power though. If we can find another spell, we'd be able to get over to that other, other island there. Yeah. I was tempted to use the Wyvern, but they have flight disabled on the Ab, Genesis, uh, I think the Ab section of Mulgaro. I don't get why Abans want to do that. Oh shit, what the hell is this? Supernova. Hmm. Nice sneakiness, though. I almost didn't even see that. I'm always not really looking for bases when I'm in Lunar Biome anyway. I'm usually just getting parts. So let's see if there's any people down here. Some players like to hide their stuff here. Unless someone already did that. Maybe they killed the player that was living in there. Alright. So be it. Uh, uh, yep, I want to make sure I'm going the correct way. Let's spin around. Pace that spout the right way. Let's see how much health I got. 2,400. Alright. Yeah, boink. Now we should have enough air power to get onto that small island. I hope. If not, then I'm rep row. Ah, damn it, the fucking lag messed it up. Son of a bitch. Asshole. Hmm. There's something else we could do too. Well, no, I can't do that because I don't have my element. But, uh. If, um. Hmm. I was trying to think of what kind of dino would be good. Because so if I could get my dinos out after breeding them quite a bit, and then I come over here with the dino, I might be able to collect more stuff a lot easier but I risk my Rex uh, being lost. Well actually I have my Rex out of the cryopod so we should be fine. So I, I don't have to worry about that at all actually. I, I, I can take my time. That's cool. <laughs> I was worried about that too. I was like oh shit I only got like five days. Like well, well, what am I gonna do? Uh, but yeah fuck it. Let's just, just get out of here. I'll worry about this another time. For now, oh shit, don't drop that, you fucker. Damn it. That would have been more metal for my base. Oh well, I meant to drop that, but this is alright. So yeah, what I want to do 
So I'm gonna get like a Dino, and uh, I want to check their oxygen. And uh, oh, I know what we should do. Yep. So you, I want to go to the. Uh, could try the volcano, but eh, I don't know. Ocean, eh? I usually lag out there, but I don't mind. I just want to gather the basics when I'm over there. Cause uh, what I want to do is I want to get like my uh, oh, my my little area working with the box on uh in my Volgaro base. This way I can put my cryopod in there when I respawn back over. And then I can take that Dino that I made to breed or whatever. And then I can take that thing, move it over, and away oh, away. And I think since my base is relatively quiet, like it's not like I don't have to worry about people attacking me or some wacky bullshit. I uh, I could probably just take my time, or well, speeding up. That would be the best thing, but yeah, we'll see. For now, let's just get what we need. Fuck it. Salt. Ugh. No. Yeah. And if anything, I can maybe craft up some scuba gear for myself if I have the parts. Let to see what that costs. Should be in grams. So, SCU. Okay, there we go. So, we need silk of pearls, chitin. Okay. Crystal, polymer. All the basics. There's something I want to try, though, since I do need polymer. I might, uh. Before I head back, I might stop by the island real quick. I'm gonna go to the penguin spot and see if I can grab a bunch of polymer that way. Cause that'd be so much easier. Let me see, I, I need more, more parts. Where the, where's the rocks at, man? I always see the tree. The fuck? I only saw like two rocks when I came in. Oh, this can work. I think I might get some salt, but at least I get the stone I need. So I need to have plenty of building materials just in case. Um, okay, I see that glitch is in the water, right? Yep, that sucks. Oh well. Yep, let's get on out of here. Let's go to the exit. And I still want to gather my polymers, so I think I'll go stop by uh, Aberration maybe. And Try to kill some Carcanus, or go to island, kill a penguin. I don't know. The center has a good spot too. Oh shit, don't see me. Don't do it, man. I know you like to steal stuff, but stay away. No. Thank goodness. I hope. <laughs> those, those birds are the most annoying thing ever. I think you stopped seeing me though, so we should be fine. Just gotta wait for this damn thing to load. But yeah, I mean, if you guys don't have polymer and you want to like get it on foot like I'm doing, or if you want to, oh, I gotta kill this guy. There we go, nice. Let's get on out of here. Do I have anything in arc data? Nope. Okay, oh, that's not what I meant to do. Damn it. Fuck the <laughs> stupid shit. Alrighty. Let's go transfer. So yeah, but it'll be a little bit before I get my transmitter, but there's a couple methods I've devised in my head. If I get this uh, crafting thing sorted, I do have uh, a way to hatch my dinos. Oh, but real quick before I keep yapping on me. Let me try to figure out where I want to go. Distinction's kind of meh. Aberration has two people, but it should be easy to still get polymer. Um, I could definitely go into water and like the fertile lake and just kill the crabs there. And then try to get out real quick. I just hope that when I spawn that no one's base is right fucking there. Because some people do that. 
Then you go, oh yeah, I'm gonna put my turret base right here. Ha ha. Then I have to go gather stuff again and fuck that. I already got my element dust. I took the time to tame a monkey. You know, there's a lot of things I already did to like help myself out. And to be honest, I would rather go near the lake, that way I don't have to do too much. So I think near the lake I can, uh, boy boy. So it should be right over here. If I tell like three is probably the best place to go. Let's see who's on. Yeah. Don't know them, but I guess we'll learn at some point. <sighs> Alrighty. I'm prop the ones that are on land though. I would like to use my monkey to kill them, and then I'll gather their resources after. And uh, so also give my monkey some training. So eventually I'm gonna breed these guys too. That way I could have a a ground dino or a dino to gather narco berries and stuff. And if I end up in a fight or uh, I need some extra defenders in my base, these guys are pretty handy for that stuff. But uh, yep. I will gather you some food instead of putting it in your inventory. Fuck it. I'd rather multiply how much food I got. Yep, simple as that. Alrighty. So yeah, sometimes the crabs show up this way, but most of the time. What's that blue thing, by the way? Is that somebody's stuff? Hmm. Oh, the water. Alright, let's also kill this guy. I want that element dust. I usually see these guys on the damn only 40? Ah, aberration does not give a fuck. What do we got? Okay. So these guys were on not too long ago. Alright. Now Bob Dog would be kinda cool too. So uh, they're pretty good for like if you're in a small part of a rat hole. Uh they're pretty good to put at like a small area to help you fight. You give them a good helmet, they can kinda do some damage to the enemy, not a lot, but if you have enough of them, they could be annoying, and they could be pushed to uh, your more difficult allies. So that's a good thing. But yep, I just want to go check on uh, the, uh, the the place with the zip line, see if it's already taken. Anyone's done anything? Is that? Oh, I thought it was someone's base with a a person on and I was like, ah, look at that. <laughs> I was excited for a minute. But yep, I think the area of interest is over here. I'm not sure if we'll be able to see it, but it should be. So I think, yeah, I usually drop down from up there and then I go here. And I think I already checked before, but I didn't see no zip lines. But yep goal is to go to the Karkonos. So I'm going to ignore this area for now. I still want to get blue gems, red gems, and all kinds of whatnot. So there's a lot of work to do. But that's alright. Meantime, let's get you down. We'll go ahead on over to the Karkonos now. This guy needs some stamina. I think the biggest worry is if there's a bunch of Spinos, or if I get pulled off my mount by a Karkonos, or if a player shows up. Because most of the time, when you start out and someone's played a little bit longer than you, or more, or has gathered better things than you, they're usually the uh, biggest threat besides all the other shit. Like, I can fight an army of Stegos with this thing, probably, but if I find Stegos that are owned by a player, that means higher health, higher melee, you know, all the things that make everything bad exist with that person. So, uh, yeah, be careful out there, people. Be safe. What's that? Oh, I thought it was a bassist for a minute. I was like, oh no. <laughs> like, not now. I don't need this in my life. Fucketh you. I think we said we need a silk of pearls too, right? For the uh, um, 
what was that, uh, boy, boy noise. Bugs. Oh, okay. Thought they were coming for me for a minute. And how many did I get? Because I know that we need a lot. Yeah, more than 200. So I think each costs uh, 20. And I'm probably going to need like two or three uh, sets. Oh shit, Ravager. No. Fuck off. Yeah. Ravagers are another thing I want to tame, but it's not right now. I don't have any extra cryopods on me. But we can always go pop to Genesis and do that when I have the chance. Nice. Still getting stone crap though, but that's alright. Yeah, just give me the chip, man. Ooh. Holy speed swimming. Why we swim so fast in the app for? What the fuck? Oh, Ravager. Nice. Yep. Another dino that could fit in my tiny rat hole base that's actually pretty good to breed is the uh, Mosa. Or Megalosaurus, whatever they're called. Not Mosa. Mosa's down in the water shit. Because uh, they're pretty small. I mean, sure to go to sleep uh, during the daytime. But they can def definitely dish out some serious numbers when they want to. Especially if you got like more than 10 of them. A small area, you know, let's say a player comes on in and they just get decimated. You know, that sounds awesome. Alright, where did that body go? Silk pearls. I want to try to use the pickaxes. Usually I kill these guys for black pearls. Oh yeah, I got 40 that time. That's cool. Nice. I hope I can find more. That'd be great. I mean, I should see you. Oh, I got 43. Uh, let me see how much it costs to make a replicator. Because if we get the pearls, I don't ever have to gather that again. Alright, 150. So if I find more of those things, they're definitely gonna do the thing. But yeah, but I think the carcanos spawn all over here. Oh, hey, there's another one. Nice. I'll take that and pickaxe for the win. Ah, just chitting? Really? Was it like a rare occasion type crap? I mean, hey, there's another one here. Make that too. Pearls. I'm trying to get one normally and see what I get. Yep, silica. More silica. Damn it. I keep getting everything but what I want. Sucks. But there's another one. Oh, yeah. Really? It's gotta be one of those like rare drops or something. That's a regular fish. Right, there's another one. Come on, man, give me the goodies. Oh, come on, really? Does it matter, like, where you hit them or something? What the fuck? Goofy shit. Also, I'm surprised I haven't seen a single, uh, carcanus. Maybe someone or buddy went through a farming run. Huh. <laughs> Weird. See, yeah, usually by now you see a shit ton. And they're also good dinos for soaking turrets and all kinds of shit. I think I saw a trilobite. Ah! Can't hide from me, bitch boy. I'm gonna try it again. Really? <sighs> More silica. Well, at least I'll have plenty of those. I'm not complaining. I need black pearls, though, man. Black pearls! I'm gonna try a hatchet this time. And then at that time, we just got regular shit. But I, like I said, silica is good too. As long as we manage to get back.